Hi, hello, this is Irina and thank you so much for coming back to me. Today we're going to talk about rectangle body shape. How to style it, how to dress and what is your perfect capsule wardrobe. How to know if you have a rectangle body shape. Well, your waist is not as defined as in the shape of an hourglass body type. Your hips will be somewhat symmetrical to your shoulders. You are on a skinny side and will most likely struggle to get some extra curves and I know because I am one. Your bust will not be way too big. Of course, there will be some examples where I show you that it's possible, but on a normal type, you will struggle to have big curves. I have the whole long explanation of what is a rectangle body shape at my blog which is dedicated to fashion and capsule wardrobe. If you have any interest and need some extra help, please visit my website at philosophfashion.com, which will be indicated down below. A capsule wardrobe is a set of basic clothes that suit any of the other pieces that you own in your wardrobe. Whenever you have no time, you need to have a capsule wardrobe that will always look good on you. This capsule wardrobe will be your saver at any time, any situation in life. I swear, because I know so many situations and capsule wardrobe was my savior. Capsule wardrobe is suitable for office or work outfits. Casual outfits, just whenever you need to go out, whatever. Going shopping outfit, like grocery shopping. Night out outfit, like going out with girls, birthday or party outfit or any special situation in life. Can you imagine that all these outfits can be pieces of one capsule wardrobe that does not need to be huge and takes only small amount of space. I love minimalism, so as a personalized stylist, this is why I highly recommend a personalized capsule wardrobe for your rectangle body shape. And here you would typically ask me, oh really? And where do I begin? How do I build my rectangle body shape capsule wardrobe? Well, here, tops for a rectangle body shape. All good basics always start with a white button-up shirt or a basic white t-shirt. And in this regard, we need to think about the quality. Do you remember that 100% cotton, silk and linen are the best choices when it comes to letting your skin breathe and feel good? The goal of your body type is to recreate an hourglass type figure like this and you need to work mostly on your bottom in order to fix the disproportionality so that you could easily achieve an hourglass shape you need to take off the stress from your shoulders and end up on the bottom. Add maximum volume to the top and emphasize with a belt or contrast on the waistline. Pay your attention to your waistline. Your body type is known for the waist that is not very emphasized and you need to go in the direction of creating an hourglass figure putting stress upon waist. I'd suggest a belt, accessories, scarf that, are, that can create a vision of a well-defined center. Avoid colors that are not part of a capsule wardrobe like neon shades do not mix bright colored items with other bright colors. In order to go in the right way here, choose only one, preferably for the top. One piece of the garment needs to be bright and the other one needs to be peaceful or pastel color shade. Jeans for a rectangle body shape. Your capsule needs to have at least one pair of the best possible pants you can think of. These jeans have to suit any occasion, even if you have to go to the wedding. Of course, I'm kidding, you're not going to go to the wedding in the jeans, but those pair of pants should be your first choice. Always remember, you make your top loose and flared. 
the bottom needs to be fitted and called, and vice versa. A flared top and bottom, fitted top. What form of jeans or pants you need to pay attention to? Of course, this is flared silhouettes, flared jeans from knee or hip lengths, perfect for the elongating if you are petite, for example. High waist jeans or trousers. Classic, no, imbla no embellishment, no holes, no applique, flowers, and etc. Skinny if your legs are fit. Avoid funny patterns like Mickey Mouse images on t shirts unless you are 7 years old. Be careful with light colored pants like white, beige, and bright colors like yellow. You might want to think about an elongated cardigan or a tunica, prefer preferably with a waistline emphasized. Blazer for a rectangle body shape. Now you will want to seal the deal and the whole look with the thing that defines your attitude but still shows some style. It's always a blazer for me. Plus it's a perfect thing for work and it fits great instead of a jacket during cold times for a capsule wardrobe is an absolute must. Let me remind you, a deep v-neck will do you good by adding enough space in the decolletage area which will elongate your body structure. Kimono, of course, it's a must-have for your body type. Are you wondering why kimono would be the perfect choice for you? I will tell you that it's not only for your body type, but it's also for all women out there. It's the most universal piece of a garment I could find. It's suitable for those that do not like getting too formal, and this is a perfect choice for getting something that will even out your upper body and bottom. It will emphasize your waistline definitely and even stress upon your neckline. You can wear it alone with your favorite jeans, a dress, leggings and shorts. It can even serve as a perfect substitution to a dress or a summer coat. It is the most feminine clothing that exists a dress for a rectangle body shape. You will say that you already know that a little black dress is a must for every woman in the world. I will say that it's not completely true. For example, I have a black dress and guess how many times I actually wore it? Right, zero. Maybe once. Because black doesn't really complement my skin tone and body shape as much as other colors do. There are other darker shades if you don't want to wear black. And this is why I remind you to take a closer look at your skin tone and figure out whether you are a warm tone skin or a cold one. For instance, I have a warm blonde hair and my skin tans easily with a yellow undertone. So I am a warm type. I can wear a green, emerald, burgundy, blue sea, light beige colors as basics. I have a helpful tip about warm and cold skin undertone. And I have a great information for you if you, if you would like to find out your skin type and colors that suit you. Just click on the link down below this video. When it comes to the type of the dress, I always recommend a flat with a well-defined waistline. A-line styles would look fantastic on your body, which, goes for, which also goes for skirts and coats. Maxi styles will definitely bring more flair and feminine taste to your shape. If you feel like you can wear fitted styles, feel free to stress on your bottom. That would be a great idea to try something from a beige color range. Very nice. A skirt for a rectangle body shape. 
a skirt is not necessarily a must if you are a pants type of girl but I'd give it a go if you want to feel more feminine and I would recommend to look at the selection that I have indicated down below that would be flat silhouettes that would be A-line silhouettes and pencil skirt if you need not to hide your bottom or you are going to wear an elongated blazer, tunica, kimono that will conceal the wear. Shoes for a perfect capsule wardrobe for a rectangle body shape. When it comes to capsule wardrobe shoes, you must know that it all depends on the lifestyle that you choose. If you are a sportsy girl, do not invest in expensive bubble tones just because a stylist said so. Take a look at something that you may actually use and vice versa, if you wear heels on a daily basis, maybe Balenciaga sneakers are not your best option for an investment. So what kind of shoes always sell good to any woman in the world are these high quality real leather shoes that are Kitten Heel in beige and black colors. Loafers in black and silver. Sneakers up to your preference. Avoid trendy ugly shoes that like that are like Balenciaga, combo shoes, funny prints, synthetic materials. Obviously, it's all as per personal preference. Just do not forget about your perfect capsule wardrobe and think whether it's a good idea to spend money on something you are not sure about. I mean, something that requires substantial spending on luxury. Thank you so much for spending your time with me. I hope that I was helpful. And once again, don't forget to visit my website for more helpful tips.